hi guys welcome to this video about how you can use your mobile phone as a webcam on your computer uh, for those who are following my channel since quite some time this is my old or my current webcam I didn't want to invest too much money and so I bought this it's not bad but the video quality is really limited some people say it has autofocus I think it does not have autofocus it doesn't focus on clothed things and sometimes I do have something really close on my desk so it doesn't really work so what I've been looking for then for some time like in uh, something with a little bit better quality something like this Logitech C920, 925, 930, whatever. Um, they have a quite good reputation, as you can see. Most of them are uh, reviews are five stars. And I thought first, yeah, I'm going to buy this one. And luckily, I've bought one for my son. He's doing some stream, online streaming, game streaming, and. Uh, video looks really good but i asked him if i can have a look at the uh, close-up so i took a book and hold it uh, like maybe let's say 10 inches away from the camera and it looked really blurry so it was absolutely not straight and it has had a lot of troubles focusing and so i figured i had to do something else so probably most of you already know that I'm currently using this camera as my main camera for doing YouTube videos because it has a really huge wide angle. It has about 135 degrees wide angle, almost like a GoPro and it has quite some good review. I mean, it's not a professional camera, but uh, you can't really complain for 200 bucks. You can make really awesome videos if you have good lighting and everything of course I'm not cutting anything I don't have uh, a, a, usually a lot of light and so so my my videos are a little bit limited but if you have good light and uh, if you use a stand and, and and everything you can make really good videos with this so I thought yeah I'm having this great camera just for 200 bucks why should I invest into something like that with uh, bad quality which is uh, yeah about um, f uh, 100 bucks and yeah it doesn't qu qu uh, provide really really much improvement so I went to uh, I googled a little bit and I found some somebody telling yeah you you can use the your mobile phone for as a webcam and so I have found this app and I've never seen that before droid webcam wireless webcam uh, I'll put down the link it's from def uh, 47 apps and it's um, as you can see hopefully you can see that a lot of people have downloaded it it has more than 1 million installs so obviously a lot of people are using that the reputation is not the best it has a lot of five star reviews but also a lot of people complaining that it never worked I tried for 20 minutes or so and uh, didn't work at all so my experience was I have installed that on the LG G5 opened that and I didn't read the instructions I, I've just seen a message like uh, video is this and this IP I just typed it in the computer and I was already connected so that's absolutely awesome and I'm going to show you a little bit how this works but of course the quality won't be the best but you will see a little bit maybe how this works so I'm starting now my phone and I'm starting the old camera, which is of course not the best, but hopefully you can be able to, you will be able to see that. So here we have the old uh, <laughs> camera, yeah, and pointing towards the LG G5. And here we have the app, as you can see, uh, that's the 
app from here so I only click on that and it opens and it gives me the Wi-Fi uh, hopefully you can see that so the Wi-Fi names you can see on which Wi-Fi you are that's important you have to be on the same Wi-Fi on your computer and then type in this IP camera or uh, this IP uh, address or even easier you can see here uh, the whole URL unfortunately it's yeah it's having huge having huge problems focusing but it, it says HTTP 192.168.0.21 and then the port it's a double point four seven four seven slash video so I have uh, then made a shortcut I hope I can open that right away so I've put down a shortcut on my desktop which I can click it has exactly this address uh, given by the app and now let's open that and we can see already it's connected and it shows the camera where I'm recording from so we now still see it you see the uh, URL online I can pick this uh, tab and put it outside so I can close that and I can resize it's just like a normal video screen which I can put here and on the side we have uh, enough space to see how this looks of course is like this, this is beside my desk it's on a uh, on a tr tripod stand looking down uh, so you can uh, see now everything and uh, yeah I hope you can see that the quality on this side is now a little bit better than on this side maybe we can compare it side by side as well so I have both cameras now side by side and this is the Microsoft, the cheap Microsoft camera for $22 and this is the LG G5 and now I'm definitely a little bit surprised because the LG seems to be totally out of focus the LG actually should be capable of doing a much better job maybe it's because of the cable which is a little bit annoying the focus I have no clue why this is I have to find out now I've removed the cable and I'm still having the problem um, of course it's a little bit uh, more close up I mean the LG has a little bit more wide angle maybe I can correct that so I've tried to touch the screen and it didn't do anything maybe I can adjust the resolution or focus or something like that maybe I find something in the settings but for now it's a huge different I mean huge disappointment from the LG G5 because I know it's doing a much better job maybe it's the app maybe it's I have no clue what the problem is when I watch the screen I have the impression the screen on my LG shows a much better picture but obviously here it's not really good so I have to find out at the moment big disappointment so if I had to choose I still would go definitely with the Microsoft webcam even when it's totally outdated but at the moment it does a better job so yeah it is I mean it works if you don't have anything if you don't have any camera it's the uh, your web uh, like uh, your mobile phone will be better than nothing but it's still not the, it's not even as good as a really cheap uh, web webcam that's uh, disappointing so instead of updating or making another video I've a little bit tried around now and I have found something not in the settings here but here it's difficult to read but it says actually HD the screen says HT and when I go there it says 
watch an ad and unlock 720p streaming for this session hope you can see it now yeah okay and then you can click on ok and you see a video i don't know mm. what that is uh, let's put that away mixer interactive streaming but probably they want me to install that and i don't know what then really happens when you close that it yeah it will come back so you can't do that what i have found now if you go on play store and look for droid cam you can find that's the the one i have installed you can see that there's another one for four dollars and 49 cents and here you can see that it, it's really bad camera quality i hope i really can improve that on the long term with the other camera from the lg g5 but uh, here it says uh, when you go to read more it's a 720p video in hd so it and it ha gets uh, f uh, frames per second boost increase more than two times or up to two times and so on uh, i think this is the way to go if you want to have better quality then you have to use um, this app you have to pay five dollars it is as it is of course you can see only fifty thousand people have been downloading but at least the reviews are better than with the other one so probably it's worth doing that uh, i will definitely close for now and i won't um, install that i have to think about if it's worse for me to do that and but if I buy, I will definitely make another video and a comparison between the Microsoft Cam and the 720 streaming from here. I was hoping to have get a little bit more than 720, maybe 1080, because oh, the LG is capable uh, doing much more than uh, 720. It's a little bit disappointing with 720, but you'll see how these things work. So that's it uh, yeah uh, that's it for now i hope i was able to help you a little bit with that if you have any questions or comments just write to the comment section below and i'm always happy to talk about the things and if you like the video give me a thumbs up subscribe my channel thanks for watching see you next time